This is huge. What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Volvo Bass and in today's video we have Fitzgerald rods to unbox. I uh, fished Fitzgerald for a very long time and if you're new here please hit that like and subscribe button and let me tell you I fished a couple other different rod brands and I was not happy with them so I'm back with Fitzgerald again. Um, nothing just compares to Fitzgerald with the durability, the look, the feel and how they handle giant fish. Um, they got a little bit more weight to them, a little bit more backbone. But that's enough of me talking, so let's get into the rods and show you exactly what I got. So first up, we have the 7'6", all-purpose, medium, spinning rod uh, from Fitzgerald. I absolutely love the eyelets, super beefed up. Uh, they really have a hard time bending. Um, this pole has a lot of whip to it, and the grips are absolutely phenomenal. I love the cork to felt um, I still like the keeper my other rods didn't have a keeper for my hook so this rod is great for drop shots small Ned rigs strolling and using the little tiny Demiki rig on the forward facing sonar here's the seven foot six all-purpose Fitzgerald rod um, this is a heavy I love the eyelets on this thing you can't beat it it's they're they're really super reinforced and these eyelets don't bend worth anything. I mean, you got great feel, super, super good backbone. Um, the grips are great. I've never had a uh, real fall off. I use a Luz LFS speed spool. I like how small the uh, grip is back here. It doesn't stick and hurt your hand. So that was the seven foot six heavy. So here's the new six eight medium heavy composite rod. Um, this thing has a lot of backbone to it, super, super thick, but it has a very, 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 very parabolic bend tip. Uh, that means you can throw crankbaits, chatterbaits, spinnerbaits, uh, swim jigs. I really wanted this as a swim jig rod. Um, I do got to get another rod for the crankbaits though. It's really going to haul monsters because it's got super, super good backbone. I'll be able to drive that hook. I'm going to drive the hook right in the bass's mouth uh, perfectly. Then I have a medium 7 foot 3. Um, this thing is perfect for um, just about anything. I mean, it's the all-purpose series. But I really got a 7 foot 3 for the Berkeley Crudge or uh, a jerk bait or deep cranking it doesn't matter i'm gonna use it for all kinds of different things but uh that's what i got it for so i'm really happy uh with this composite series so far i cannot wait to use it like i said it's a new uh fishing rod from fitzgerald I've had all the other ones. I traded this one in basically for a cranking rod. This is supposed to be a cranking rod, but uh, I think that it's going to excel as a jerkbait rod because of the soft tip. Um, like I was saying, they re-overhauled their reel seats too. It's got a fatter reel seat where your, uh, your reel sits up in there. Um, so your reel doesn't slip off. You know, from Fitzgerald fishing, they fish in Florida most of the time. So you gotta yank fish out of heavy cover like weed mats and bogs and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> but I think it's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool rod so far. I can't wait to sling this thing tomorrow. So like I was saying, you know, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty neat. But we're gonna get that trolling motor tomorrow as well. I probably should have it by lunchtime. So hopefully we can be on the water tomorrow. So me and Pastor G will be going out tomorrow to go fishing. Um, we still got to do some pre-fishing for our tournaments, but uh, 
I think our tournaments start on the 30th, I believe. I can't remember. Um, but you know, we'll definitely get some good run with these rods tomorrow. And like I said, if you're new here, please hit that like and subscribe button. And uh, I think that's going to do it for this video. So if you have any questions about fish drilled rods, uh, leave a comment down below and I will do my best to answer them. I know a lot about these all-purpose rods. So until next time, I'll catch you all in the water.